poetry monstrosity. The words I used to put on the page would be disconnected, fragmented, different ideas clashing. I was told what I was writing wasn't real poetry, but then I discovered a new way of looking at words. A storm brewed inside my mind and wouldn't blow away. That is when it took me. An entity made of twisting sentences and challenges to traditional form. I surveyed the classroom from my perch, holding tradition firmly in my wrinkled grip. The rules of writing weren't mine to make, but only mine to enforce. This is how true art is created. Not by standing in the edge of creativity, waiting to trip. You must stand strong, let the traditional rhythm make its course. The words must flow like skates dancing on ice. A single crack in your path and you must start again. Don't stray from a form. There is no need for added spice. The efforts of those who created the system will not be in vain. I am a being of pure persuasion, of thoughts and ideas, abstract and unique yet known. The rules to me are nothing but blinding. While you make your perfect and neat little rows and columns, I will build empires. I will overthrow your practice of precision. The rules and pages bend to my will. I create dark, dark domains, domains from your pitiful attempts at power. I create explosions of emotions and Deafening silences. Look at this mess you've created. How is anyone supposed to understand? Instead of creating a masterpiece, you've created something bland. Without structure, your poems are nothing but letters on a page. Proper poetry is supposed to be reformed, something tasteful and aged. It will run smoothly from line to line, a pattern of syllables and rhythm. The only way to write true poetry is with structure and vision, not this mixed match of thoughts riddled with incoherence. Almost never did I expect I would end up here, broken, bruised, consumed by fear. At the cusp of freeform insanity, without rhyme or reason, or verse. Verse, verse subverted, subversive, subversive, life, society betrayed and backstabbed. Your fear is delicious, O oh pretentious pedestrian pedagogue. I have devoured your rhymes, destroyed your reason, and I have freed the young minds from your constrictive counsel. Never to sonnet again. Now perish. Never have I ever felt such poetic delight. I'm free to write whatever I never thought I could write before. The quickness of my thoughts replacing hours of stuttering. My fluency taking over the pauses. Look at all the possibilities. Will poetry ever be the same? Will, Will I, I ever, ever be, be the same? same?